Wow. to see tractors on his day off. <laughs> hey look, a little Luke size snowmobile. Yeah. Do you want to sit on it? Yeah. Yeah. It won't start, buddy. How do you drive it? Do you want to go see the bulldozer? Yeah. Go look at the bulldozer. Let's go. Yeah, come, come. Let me go. Okay. It's scary? It's okay. It's not scary. Come look at the front. What is that? What are you driving? A John Deere bulldozer. Wow. What a big guy you are. Another gator? Yeah. Yeah, do you want to look at that one? Yeah. Or do you want to look at other tractors? That one's even a little bigger. Whoa. Whoa. Hey. Oh, look, that one has airless tires. Look at that. Whoa. Wow. Uh -oh. Yeah, so you never need air in it. That's crazy. You like that one? No, you say. It's not Luke size? But this one not. Which one's Luke sized? Uh, that one. That one? Yeah. I bet I can find you some Luke sized tractors here. Do you want to see where they are? Yeah. Come with me. Yep. We love that. Well, I bet you do. Yeah. Yeah. What is that? A combine and a tractor? Yeah. Wow. You like that old snowmobile? Yeah. Yeah. You don't get to sit on it though. You can only be beside it. Yeah. 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 It's cool? Yeah. Yeah. What is it? John Deere, yeah? Yeah. Are the wheels big? Yeah. How big? Oh, go stand beside it and see how big. Wow. No, you're not that big like tire.
Could it be? Could the snow finally be gone? Still have a trampoline to finish building. I just got that far and then it started to snow. But uh, this grass is starting to green up and I don't have a lawnmower. Uh, Mama Cat wants an electric lawnmower. I get it. I see the convenience and the, the quiet and ease, not dealing with gas. But in the meantime, I've got this thing and uh, I don't know honestly where it's from or where I got it or what's wrong with it other than I've stolen parts off of it. I suppose the first question has to be, is it seized? At least I was smart enough to plug that uh, intake port. I spent yesterday freeing up this cable that was jammed up. Doesn't appear to be seized. Nope. Actually has pretty good compression. So that's a plus. And we got spark. What happens if the doctor makes a house call? Ow! Well, I think these are the parts off that mower. gasket could not be any crustier uh, or the primer button it could probably be cleaned up but then I need I don't think I have any bowl gaskets or primer buttons and I can probably get this card for like 20 bucks there's a number right there and probably have it for tomorrow Oh, are you gonna come help me search for a carburetor, huh? Yeah. Who's a good boy? Oh, ho, ho. my stratty man. This is a Tecumseh, though. Do you know anything about Tecumsehs, or are you only a Briggs and Stratton man? Huh? You're only a Briggs and Stratton man, right? You can't help me with a Tecumseh. Do you know anything about it? Hmm? Yeah, you're a nice boy. Okay, I'm gonna keep Googling. If, like me, you have the misfortune of working on one of these newer Tecumseh engines, see those tabs in there? Just remove those tabs, loosen them off. Uh, I've already done it because I only have one free hand, and ta-da! There's the engine numbers that I've, I've been looking for any kind of ID number because the model number is gone from this thing and the number on the carb isn't working, but this number should get me where I need to be to get a carb number. Well, I went with a Part Zen brand carb and I had to guess a little bit at the part number because I couldn't get exact match um, I don't know hopefully it'll work should be pretty close and uh, as long as it makes it run really chose this one because it comes with an air filter which is nice I need that and uh, comes with some linkages and springs which is cool gaskets and a spark plug which I'll probably not use Let's 
see. Uh, I can see already there's a that vent is different. Uh, but outside of that, I think it ought to work fine. Fine, fine enough, should be. Um, whatever doesn't match will make match. I'll just plug that and uh, call it good. It's not gonna interfere with anything, so. <sighs> well, it would just be too much to ask for it to be easy. I'm missing one of the intake bolts, so after a whole bunch of fiddling around to get the linkage set up, and I did replace that spring because the old one was really stretched out, um, I can't actually bolt it up. So I wanted to have this thing running right away, and uh, until I find a bolt that's suitable, uh, which is tricky because there's not a lot of space right in here. Um, we're kind of stuck. Ah, there's also this. <sighs> Found some screws that'll work, but uh, this is not going to fit over that red pipe there, so I think that's just going to Come out of there for better or worse. Ah. Now that'll work. Here I've got the exhaust fitted and the cover and the fuel tank. And um, I actually did find the missing uh, bolt, but it's rather, it's rather embarrassing. So I'd rather not even say where I found it. I think she might get smoky. Whoa, holy backfire. 